वेलकम बैक टू इनफी ज्ञान माई डियर फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी हैव अनदर वेरी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम एलजेब्रा वी हैव टू सॉल्व टू माइनस एक्स होल पार फोर प्लस टू एक्स माइनस वन होल पार फोर इक्वल टू एक्स प्लस वन होल पार फोर हेयर एक्स बिलोंग्स टू रियल नंबर सो लेट्स गेट इज स्टार्टेड विद अवर सब्सटीट्यूशन इज स्ट्रेट अवे लेट एस से टू माइनस एक्स इक्वल टू ए दिस ब्रैकेट इज a and let's say 2x minus 1 is b so i will write 2x minus 1 equal to b now i will add these two equations so 2x minus x x 2 minus 1 plus 1 this will be equal to a plus b which is here will be writing a plus b so if i will write our equation then this will be a power 4 plus b power 4 equal to a plus b whole power 4 now i have to expand this rhs using pascal triangle and binomial expansion so let us check for power 4 what would be our expansion coefficient so i will write 1 1 1 for power 2 1 2 1 will be the coefficients For power three, one three three one, and for this problem, one four six four one. We will use these numbers are expansion coefficients. Let's expand. A plus b whole power four equal to a power four plus b power four. Coefficients are one four six four. One. So I will write here a power four with expansion coefficient four. I will write four a cube b with expansion coefficient six. I will write six a square b square. Next coefficient is four. I will write four a b cube. And last one is one, which will be b power four. right hand side is a power 4 plus b power 4 now i will subtract a power 4 plus b power 4 from both the sides so these two terms will be over now i will write our equation 4a cube b plus 4ab cube plus 6a square b square equal to 0 Equation is looking divisible by two. Let's divide by two. Two a cube b plus two a b cube plus three a square b square equal to zero. Now I can write equation as two is common from first two terms, and a b is also common in the bracket. So I will write a square plus b square. Then we have three times a square b square equal to zero. Now I can consider a b also common, so I will write here a b in the bracket. It will be two a square plus two b square plus three a b equal to zero. So from here I can conclude three equations. either a equal to 0 or b equal to 0 or 2a square plus 2b square plus 3ab equal to 0 let us solve our third equation first i will write here 2a square plus 2b square Plus three times a b equal to zero. And first equation was a equal to zero. Second was b equal to zero. Now I will consider two a square plus two b square as a square plus b square. And then I will write a square plus b square. Then this three a b term, I will split two a b. 
and then I will write AB. So 2AB plus AB is 3AB. A square plus B square, A square plus B square will give us 2A square plus 2B square. Right hand side is 0. So from these three terms, I can write A plus B whole square plus A square plus B square plus AB. Let's multiply with 4. So we need to divide by 4 also. So I will write 1 over 4 times 4A square plus 4B square plus 4AB equal to 0. Or we can write A plus B whole square plus 1 over 4 times 4A square I will write as it is. 4B square I will write B square then 4AB term the last one and then 3B square equal to 0. B square plus 3B square is 4B square. Now from these three terms, we will be writing one perfect A square. So A plus B whole A square plus 1 over 4 times, this is 2A plus B whole A square. 2A whole A square is 4A square, B whole A square is B square, 2 times 2A times B is 4AB plus 3B is square equal to 0. So from here I can write A plus B whole A square equal to minus 1 over 4 in bracket 2A plus B whole A square plus 3B square. Now left hand side is positive as we are having whole A square. And this curly bracket will be sum of two squares. So always positive. So positive number with multiplication with minus sign. This will give us negative. So in real numbers, positive number cannot be equal to negative number. So we will get complex solutions. Or the possibility to accept A equal to 0 and B equal to 0 will be the solution of equation. So I can write here A equal to 0 and B equal to 0. Then the last equation will be true. And our first two equations were the same. A equal to 0, B equal to 0. Let's solve. This bracket was A and this bracket was B. So in place of A, we can write 2 minus X equal to 0. In place of B, we can write 2x minus 1 equal to 0. So we can get x equal to 2 from here. And 2x is equal to 1 from here. And then we will divide by 2 both sides. We will get x equal to half. So our final solutions will be 2 and half. Now we will check our solution. Let's verify. I will write verification. Let's check x equal to 2. Equation is here. So I will write LHS. 2 minus x whole power 4. So 2 minus 2 whole power 4 plus 2 times 2, 4 minus 1 whole power 4. So 2 minus 2 is 0 plus 4 minus 1 is 3. 3 power 4 is 81. So LHS is 81. Now we will check RHS. X plus 1 whole power 4. So 2 plus 1 whole power 4. This will be equal to 3 power 4 which is equal to 81. So LHS equal to RHS. We will say 2 is true solution. X equal to half. LHS 2 minus half whole power 4 plus 2x will be 1. So I will write 1 directly. 1 minus 1 whole power 4. So 2 minus half is 3 over 2 whole power 4. 
second term is 0. So I can write 3 power 4 81, 2 power 4 16. Our LHS is 81 over 16. Now we will check RHS. Half plus 1 whole power 4. This will be equal to 3 over 2 whole power 4. So 81 over 16 which is matching with our LHS. So x is equal to half is also verified solution. And this brings the end of the video. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck.